Am I? What's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Big Dame. For some reason, I went 0-2 today, but that's okay. I've been uh, busy recovering and coming from work conferences, you know. But I'm here. So I hope you guys are ready for the top three action of Tekken 7. Um, we got a very special guest in the building today, coming all the way up from the Boston, Massachusetts, still electric, coming out to show us his presence here in Philly for Go For Broke. And also a surprise appearance for Go For Broke, someone who's um, been making quite some noise lately, Mr. Blazer Purr. He's kind of like at 20% right now because he hasn't gotten no sleep coming from work. But let's see how he does. Um, I believe we're in uh, winner's finals. Yep, we're in winner's finals here. So, um, like I said, top three. Um, we're going to showcase that. But yeah, here we go. There's some great tech and action going on. I don't know where Afro is at. Maybe you could join me to commentate. But, uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell him to come up here. He ain't got nothing else to do. Uh, but yeah, guys, go for broke. Uh, we just finished up uh, King of Fighters. That went very well. Uh, Melty Blood is finishing up. That's going to be doing an off, off stream. Um, we're going to finish up here in this Tekken. Yeah, we got a nice little little crowd today. Not not too, uh, you know. You know, there's a lot of stuff going on. You got Dream Hack, you got Bread and Butter, like all these other events. But we're glad that everyone came out here to show some support. Yeah, come on, Afro. You might, you might as well commentate with Mr. Wins. I don't know what Kyle's saying, but. Am I too close? My bad, y'all. Oh, okay. <laughs> I just started, like, scooching up. I'm like, wait. <laughs> huh? Uh, <laughs> I was, like, I was like real close up to the camera, like, uh-oh. <laughs> well, well, well. I don't know. I don't know. Where, oh, I'm about to say, where's your little headset? What did Kyle say? Yes. <laughs> what did Kyle say? Yes. Did he say something about me? Yes. <laughs> uh, what's cracking, y'all? It's once again your main man. With what the did you say? Afronomical. As always, here to entertain the brothers, the sisters, and of course the non-binary haters. We out here at Go For Broke. It's a little, it's a little turnout, about six people. We still out here doing some damage and getting it in. And today we got one of the homies from Boston making a little invasion today. And he's going to be going up against Blazer Purr of the Philly area. So Philly versus Boston, still electric out here. I'm curious to see how this match is going to go because I know for a fact that he's got his Athena, he's got a double gen. But I'm very curious as to how Blazer's going to handle this. His Lily's very solid, and he too also has it. So are you ready for still electric? Let's find out. That's what I want to know. Well, we're going to see here. I mean, Blazer Purr was playing against me with Safina, so... He should have the, uh, <laughs> We're already. Well, I don't know what's going on now, but. We are already swapping sides. It's like, listen, man, I want it P2. I'm going to get it one way or another. And again, putting the pressure on already. Winner's finals game one. Put some plus frames in his face, man. And again on a stage, like, oh, nice size. Oh, he didn't fully commit. Oh, yeah. we're going to the wall. And, yep, one of the best wall combos in the game. Never drops. Plus frames in his face again. Just keep putting. It's time for wall oppression. Spins it. He's got a sidewall oh, situation. Got the, yep, got the wall bounce. Oh, he's still got him at the wall here. Oh, nice sidewalk there from Danny. Mm. All right, first game going to Stole Electric here. Trying to do some damage out here on Broad Street. Nice duck there. Oh, oh. and the parry. <laughs> That's my favorite move. She really whipped out the infinity going on you, dog. That's wild. <laughs> oh, he's putting hella pressure on him right now. Again, just slowly backing him up. Oh, oh my, my goodness. God. The back, the backflip. 
Back foot launcher. We go into the wall. Yes. And, and didn't get the full combo. Oh. He's got him at the wall here. Let's see if he can put some pressure on him. He's just outside of range of rage. Nice punish. And the parry again. Both got the red dress. Who's going to spend it first? Oh, oh and the get up kick <laughs> to deny rage. Ooh, barely. Barely. He got away with murder just now. He just did. Oh, he went for the 2-2 two, two strength. Full 2-2 two, two strength. Oh, he a built different to Fina. It's rare I see someone finish that strength. Playing very conservative. Nice float. We're going to the wall here. I didn't get the full cartwheel. Okay, we're going smart. We don't want to give him free frames. Free frames. Oh, not mm. the ankle biters. Are we going not quite to the wall? And FF3, back it up. Excuse oh, me. Oh, two times. FF4. Oh, he's got rage. He can make this hurt. Oh, he tried to sidewalk. That is surprisingly good. Tra no, he, he dropped it. it. He dropped it. He and the DF1. Okay. Laser first, showing life. My man's out. He, he, he doing a little damage right now. Now, again, mind you, he does still have familiarity with the Zafina matchup himself. He does play this character himself. So he at least has an understanding of how to handle her. Now he's just got to deal with the still electric matchup, and that's going to be the hard part. Actually, that's capped. Zafina's the hard part in general. <laughs> <laughs> As if Zafina's the easy part. What am I talking about? I play this character. I know she's irritating. Nice punish. Oh, not the wall splat. Oh, my God. Her DF14 is gross at the wall. Oh, spins it. Put some plus frames on his face. Oh, he, oh, he did the full strength. strength. Giving him counter hit damage. Okay. What? One game in favor of Blazer of her here in winner's finals. Not bad. Not bad. And I think that was immediate rematch. I don't think he's switching. No, he's I, not switching. I don't think he's going with the devil gen unless it, really necessary. I mean, still electric was, was playing solid. It was just... Just a couple instances here and there where he just got caught. So um, let's see how he does in this match here. Oh, didn't fully commit. Slowly poking away at his ankles here. Oh, and still gets the combination. Nice conversion. Oh, my God. That's nice. That was, that was solid. That was solid. Wow. The tip of her toes got her, got her with that spring kick. Nice punish again. He's got rage. Oh, and that's the sidewalk he wanted. I know he wanted that. First time he didn't get it. First time he didn't get it. Second oh, time nice strong. launch. Nice with punish. with punish from Blazer Purr. And, 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 nice. And the side switch, that could have been a very dangerous side switch. Oh, nice duck. Put the wall standing one, too. To the wall. Oh, my God. Where'd his health bar go? He and he got floated. It. That DF1-2-1 one, one from Zafina is so consistently good. <laughs> My goodness. Mm. Oh, again, in the, in the back one plus two. You don't kick me, two. I'll kick you. Oh, nice sidewalk again with the launcher. Give me that DF2, baby. Oh, in the mid off of on her on his wake up. Balls. Titanium nut sack. My legs. Oh, on the one plus two. We break those. Don't touch me. Oh, oh that's a big whip. This is going to hurt. He's not dead. Now he's got rage. And he's, oh, my God. Just raw F4. Just raw F4. It's a smack down rage drive from Lily. I'll be damned. And again with the parry. Back it up, brother. He's too close. He's still in the pandemic, Lovato. Man, that hand of hers. <laughs> Listen, man, they gave her the Infinity Gauntlet. Now she she going brazy. Ooh, slowly fighting his way off the wall here. You do not want to be there with this arena. Nice sidestep again. And again, there's so many rage drives being yes. snuffed out in this game. This FF3. It's too many of them. They just said, I'm just going, I'm just going, let it out. Oh, oh not the no. launcher. And the front flip. What's for breakfast? Oh, he's 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 leaning towards the wall. That's where you don't want to be here with his Athena. Get your back off the wall, Broth. Oh, oh my and the goodness. counter hit. FF4 finally hit its mark. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. What's for breakfast? And nice break of the stomp. My heart. Spent it. Oh no, not the DF1 plus two! He slapped him in the kidneys! 
He's still got he's still got a chance. He's got him at the wall oh. and the mini duck DF one two. That was clutch from still electric. One one even. My man's just slapped the daylights out of his kidneys just now. My man's lean forward say I want the right one. <laughs> not the kidneys. Kidney stones. Oh, not the back turn. Oh, with the spike down. He's got him at the wall here. And again with the DF4 one. Ah, yes, the rich girl drop kick. <laughs> Every rich girl oh character gosh. has one. Listen, Karin does the same thing. What other rich girl character in fighting games has the... Oh, my God. The Kazuya special. Excuse me. Lily special. <laughs> this how, many, how many rich girl fighting game characters are there? I think it's like... Uh, what's, the, what's the name? Other chick from Namco Capcom has the same drop kick. Every rich girl character has that drop kick. I'm trying to figure out which other <laughs> <what the> character. <laughs> Ain't no one Soul Calibur does that. They'll probably have somebody do that in the next game. Soul Calibur 7. It's going to be freaking. It's going to be Sophie or Cassandra. <laughs> I'll bet cash money. He's got him at the wall here again with the rage drive. It's, he's got the threat of rage drive here. Spends it. What's for breakfast? Again, just putting plus frames on his face here. Oh, and counter hit mm -hmm. FF1. He's slowly weeding away the health bar. We break those. Don't touch me, brother. Oh, he went. Oh, just a sliver of health. He doesn't have rage anymore either. Oh, nice low parry. Wow. That was clean. He was prepared for that. 15 wow. seconds left. And he's still got a slight life lead. 10 seconds here. Spent it. And the back one plus two. Mm, Caught him with the first Russian now. Seven, he had to hit seven seconds left. It's just barely enough time to work with. Oh, that's unfortunate. And again, just putting hella plus frames on his face and making him guess with his Athena. The tarantula stance. Stuffed out, stuffed the parry out. Well, again, try to run him with the F4. We punish those, my brother. What you got? What you got? Oh, that was a duck. He didn't launch. We take those anyway. To the wall. Give me that. With the flip over. Oh, oh he tried to sidewalk. Yep. Yep. Not that time, brother. That is a no round brown from Still Electric in the second and a third game. Excuse me. 2 1 in favor of. Of electric infinite over stage? her right now. Oh, Kinder Gem. Kinder Here's the reason why I wouldn't go infinite stage. That's a massive double edged sword. Both of these characters are the queens. It's like Alyssa, Kunimitsu, Zafina, and Lily. All the queens of movement. He's kind of getting outplayed right now. So the last thing you really want to do is not have walls. Because he's still doing fine and getting the wall pressure and the wall damage. But especially against Zafina, she's harder to catch than Lily is. She just is. <laughs> Can Lily do it? Yes. Do you want to? Why would you do all that work? <laughs> On again, the DF1. Give me the ankles. Oh, he's really starting to just steamroll right now. All these plus for oh! oh, and he jumped over the DF4. Going to get a pretty solid combo from this to the wall. Not quite. No. So the sidewall kind of saves still Electric's live, too, just slightly. So... And that's four rounds straight for Stole Electric. 2-1 so far. It's looking a little rough for Blazer in this game four right now. Big whiff punish again with that DF-1-4. This character's grow. Oh, not the down one. The time to go to the no. And the DF-4-1 again. He's oppressing so hard. Oh, my goodness. And the back three stomp. Okay, we got the wall splat. Oh. oh, dropped the combo, and that's, yeah, that's unfortunate. Try to kidney stone again, and that low. Mm, the famous low from Safina. That low is gross. Two, that's five rounds straight right now. He tried to kidney stone again. He really wants that move. He's really trying to make him guess. To the wall, and, eh, eh. Nice conversion, half-life. Oh, he tried to go for a parry on wake up. Yeah, get her out of tarantula stance. You do not want to deal with that. Nice, nice patience. Didn't do a full string because he definitely launched him for that last time. 
Oh, in okay. the hop kick. Nope. Got floated. Trade. Oh, nice conversion there. Give me those whiff punishes. He's got rage. I'm about nice. to say, please whiff punish there. <laughs> He's showing signs of life. If he ain't out yet. Again, round start stomp. Oh, and he caught him. To the wall. That's going to hurt. That's half-life. That's half-life. And... That is GG still a Tarantula. 3 1 over Blazer Par with the Zafina. That is a hell of a set. Yep. And Blazer Par was looking real good in that first game, but mm -hmm. whoa, still Electric turned it up. Yeah. My, my boy turned it up. Well, it's okay. Uh, Blazer Par is going in the losers. Um, he'll probably come back. Maybe he'll go with his Zafina of his own. Maybe. It's for. I was very curious to see if he would do it. I didn't think he would. Realistically, because it's a Fina match or first stuff, no one wants to deal with that. As someone who plays that character, no, <laughs> that's that's chaotic. <laughs> All right, let me do my thing. Well, baby. guys, now we got Afro versus Blazer Purr, and the winner of this will uh, go see Still Electric. Will Blazer Purr try to get the run back, or will Afro make a appearance to stop Blazer Purr and then go against him? No, well, we'll find out. But anyway, guys, we're here at Go for Broke. Hope you guys are enjoying everything. Uh, shout outs to Shadow Royalty for uh, running the stream today. Uh, we appreciate you guys. You know, one of the best uh, teams and orgs out there right now, you know, compared to another one I shall not name. But um, anyway, though, <laughs> you can edit that out if you want. Uh, <laughs> 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 Okay, but uh, yeah, we're about to get into our losers finals here now. Afro gonna get himself set up, but um, yeah. So this is losers finals, and after that, grand finals, and then after that, I believe guilty gear. I don't know, but uh, we'll find out. Um, but yeah, guys, make sure you guys uh, uh tune in uh sh or follow uh Shadow Royalty for all their events that they do. Um, they do have um, uh, a thing called a uh, rollback, rollback on block. You know, their PC uh, tournament for DNF duels. So every every Wednesday, PC, not Xbox, but PC. <laughs> Shout out to Japan. Hopefully, they can get get in the game and start making some stuff for Xbox. But anyway, though. Actually, we are getting um, Guilty Gear on Xbox in spring on Xbox Game Pass. So, <laughs> And um, what's the other game? There's another one coming with it. I can't remember. Blaze Blue. Yeah, to cross tag. <laughs> I'm like, what was the other one? Yeah. So here we go. Bang versus Lily, and we're on Dumo de Sirio. Let's see if Afro can uh, make an upset here, or will Blaze of Her continue on to go see Still Electric again? Let's see. Okay, they're both pushing buttons here. <laughs> okay, Afro with a nice sweep. Gets to the wall. Yep. Oh, tries to go for the Rage Drive, but gets denied. Afro up one round in this match here. Oh, okay. Nice corkscrew kick there. All right, Afro trying to get it in, but then nice whiff punish there to the wall. Okay, Afro steamrolling this uh, match here. One more and he gets the first one. Blaze Bird trying to get himself in, but it's, um, Afro's having some great defense. Okay, gets the stomp there. Oh, no whip punish there, but nice. Uh, Lock punish there. This is gonna go to the wall. Not quite. 
And the low mid combination, Afro goes ahead and gets the first match here. Laser Purge is going to go right into rematch here. Again, this is going to be three out of five. Okay, good start here with the counter hit. Did not get the full wall combo. Afro trying to find his way back, gets the sweep. And Blazer Purr with the lows though, goes ahead and gets himself on the board. Nice hop kick to evade the mid. Alright, so in the uh, final round here. Well, not the final round, but round three. Laser Fur is um, showing some life now here. Oh, Matterhorn! Breaks the wall. No, it does not break the wall. Alright, Afro said enough of this. And just a simple jab there. Blazer Purr now gets himself a match here. One to one. And Afro said we're gonna go straight back. No stage change. Nice sidestep into the hop kick there from Blazer Purr. And the side wall does not save Afro's life. Blazer Purr gets the round here in this third match. Oh my goodness. Hopped over the low to low crush it and gets himself a perfect afro going in at the moment right now. The hop kick here from Blazer Purr. All right, got the pressure on him now, though. Got him against the wall. There it goes. Is that is death. Wow. Okay. Oh, well not the not the Matterhorn, but a nice backflip. Getting him the launch. Oh, camera stuff. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Blazer Purr gets two perfects in a row. Two to one. What is Afro going to do here? Afro is pondering at the moment right now. On the stage select. Is he gonna go to jungle outpost too? Arctic snowfall where the boys become men. <laughs> if you can't play on the infinite stage, you're not man enough for it. <laughs> At least that's what Commander says. <laughs> <laughs> Round one. All right, guys, here we go. Could be potential last match if Blazer Pearl wins. Or let's see if Afro can bring it to a game five. Oh, good whip punish there. Oh, and Afro just <laughs> dominantly taking over that round. Very aggressive there.
Okay, so... 33 seconds left, and Blazeford got the lead. And he got the round there. Very good aggressiveness shown there from Blazeford as well. Now he's throwing away. Ooh, try to go for the uh, setup there. But Afro said, no, I'm not falling for it. Gets the 4-4. Four, four. All right, Afro is one round away of bringing it to a game five. Both spacing each other out here. Plus, uh oh, gets him with the throw. Wow, they both try to go for their moves. Oh, <laughs> final round potential final match here. For Blazer Purr, or can Afro bring it to a game five? Looks like Blazer Purr got the nice life lead right now. Oh, we try to go for Matterhorn there. This should be it. And yes, it is. So Blazer Purr. We'll go ahead and move on to see Still Electric again in Grand Finals. All right. Well, guys, there you have it. We're going to have a run back now. Blazer Purr versus Still Electric. Interesting match. Hope uh, Afro comes and joins me again. <laughs> but no, it was a very good match overall. So now we're going to have the run back here, Grand Finals. Um, I believe Blazer Purr is probably going to stick with the Lily. Still Electric probably will probably still deal with the Safina most likely. But he does have, they both have options. Welcome to the King of Iron Fist Tournament 7. As my colleague come joins me. What did you think about your match? Honestly, that was a solid match. God knows that me and Blazer go back and forth so many goddamn times. He usually be getting the best of me with that shit because he's played me enough times where he knows exactly how I play. So every time this man hit, like, a sidestep and I'm like, God, stop learning shit. Because <laughs> he just did everything right. I can't be mad at that. That was a good set. I actually have to play outside of the box with him, and that's – if people know me, I only recently started playing more ignorant. Usually I play like a very somewhat boring thing, and people have told me like, yo, you don't play ignorant enough. And half the time I have to whip out that ignorance on him just to like hold it down. <laughs> Especially when it comes to Lily. Now realistically, someone was probably thinking, what were you thinking? Mm. Picking infinite stage with this character. I'm like, trust me, I had a, I had a formula. <laughs> oh my gosh. Because the thing is, is that if I play him on that stage, then I'm gonna be real. Yeah. I'm gonna a whole lot more like than in terms of playing on a walled stage, because he'll just stand there and s sit there and take it. Which is why you saw me just DF four three on wake up. I want to see if he presses a button, because it he definitely is a little more, at least in my opinion, conditionable on an infinite stage than a walled stage. I know that sounds crazy because I play Fang, but it's more so the player and less of the character. If he played any other character, I probably would have still picked Infinite. <laughs> gotcha. I'm kind of cracked out. I'm that playing player that loves Infinite Stage. Zentaros hates me, I know, I understand. <laughs> but in the meantime, I'm actually very surprised that he picked the Devil Gym for this. I thought he was going to go back to the Zafina. He was hovering over her at first, but maybe he was like, yeah, let me, let me experiment with the Devil Gym. Let's see. 
I could definitely say in terms of Devil Gen, there's only, say, two people in our area that I know who play this character. One of them's Gil Game, the Gil God. But other than that, this character doesn't have a whole lot of traffic. Then again, this character doesn't have a whole lot of traffic, period, in this game. He's not commonly seen, at least in these days. So DJ is definitely going to be, at least the way I see it, matchup knowledge. Mm -hmm. For Blazer especially, for this type of set. Oh, again. Sorry. That's two straight so far for Danny in this first game. And he's looked real good since the last game, too, where Blazer took the first game and then he won the next three with mm. pretty reasonable, convincing fashion. Oh, oh my the goodness. that, too. Oh, that's going to smart. Oh, this is going to be it. Yep. Three straight. Yeah, that wow. was honestly a whole lot of knowledge checking. No Ryan Brown. He definitely threw the book at him in that first game. <laughs> it was hella throwing the book at him. I'm about to sign up for NRB Academy. <laughs> Lord have mercy, Jesus. They're accepting all students. I'm about to move to Georgia. Oh, damn. And back one, two. Counter hit. Oh, and DF2. he catches him floating. Like. We don't talk enough about how this character's cracked out. <laughs> Devil Jin's kind of stupid. Oh, nice my interrupt. goodness. He said, I'm, a, I'm done with this pressure. That's a very bold interrupt from Blazer. What? I don't know. What? Nah, I didn't think so. What? Yeah, I, I wasn't sure. I don't think he would have had he enough health robbed. for that anyway. He I don't robbed. think he had enough health for that. He got robbed. I don't Steve think he would have. Me personally, I don't <laughs> think he would have survived. I think he would have. He had very low health at that point. I think that kick went. Uh, then again, know. it's also Devil Jin, so that's a whole different demon in itself. And this might be. No, didn't go to the wall. Nice duck. But he's really kind of getting hard knowledge checked right now. Nice counter hit. Get the pick up. Give me that. Give me that, brother. Hundred over. Right. So once again, showing signs of life. Blazer per. Yes, nice with punish. I like it. I like it. Lily just jumping everywhere. Y'all talking about my character. Oh, no. Believe me. I'm irritated at Lily, too. You can't keep her still. Why do you think I was DF4, 3, plus 4 so much? So I was like, DF3 plus 4. I want you to stay where I want you. <laughs> Oh, that's going to smart. He's still alive. He's got rage. Is he going to die with it, though? Nice sidestep. Wow, the, the, the crush. chest. What's for breakfast? He's got him in rage now. Nice spike down of the spring kick. There we go, Blazer. Nice conversion on wow. that last round. Wow, I thought it was still Electric's round there, to be honest. Oh, again. Nice duck again with the wall standing 2-2. Two -two. He's ducking a lot of these strings. He ain't having it. We punish those. Back it up. Yep, get, get that breathing room. Got to get away from the wall. Oh, nice punish again from Still Electric. And he's got Rage again. Floated wow, him, so him the damage the is going to be reduced. But he's still going to get... I uh, didn't get a whole lot from that. And again, generic low. All right, final round. Final round in game two. Let's see if he can tie it up. Just slowly poking away at the ankles here, Blazer. Nice. Du oh, I respect it. He tried it. He, he got the duck. He got the duck. Just a little slow to the punch. Still Electra just absolutely putting hard pressure on him with just fang. With just the, excuse me, not fang. Double gin jabs alone. Shout outs to mm. Electric. Always there when you need it. Always there when you need him. Look at the dashing. He's got it. Nice block of the rage drive. Oh, he tried to go for the parry. Nobody. Yep, that's getting punished. <laughs> <laughs> two no, zero wait, no, for. No, no. It wasn't no brown brown, oh, yeah, but it is it. two zero. I'm. Didn't, I'm not. I wasn't thinking he was gonna go with another character anyway. He's got the Zafina. He put down the Lydia. He's got the Kuni, But honestly, go with the tried and true. I'd be inclined to agree. I wouldn't switch here either. Oh, oh nice we, float. We we start out sixty second mashing. An absolute scramble. <laughs> He's really making him guess at the wall right now. He's using a lot of these back one cancels to really make him guess. You want to try to whiff punish? Nobody home. Still getting his back off the wall, getting some breathing room. Still electric. Nice oh. whiff punish to the laser. 
Oh, try to go for hop kick on wake up. Nobody. And the hell sweep. I'm about to say, couldn't he pick again. up from that? Uh, not necessarily from there. I think he was oh, going okay. too far. All right, still electric. Two rounds away of becoming your tournament champion here. Really hard to press in Blazer for a nice duck. With the float combo again to the wall. Get all the damage you need with the flip over. Oh, he couldn't cap. Yeah, he couldn't cap. Cameraman. Again, just trying to bait him in. Not want to be here with a double chain. He's got rage. He can make this hurt. Double lows. Give me them ankles, baby. 1-1 one, one even again. Still fighting back. Oh, oh an immediate round start up back. four. Oh, my gosh. You madman. Oh, not the unblockable. Oh, no. Not the burning fist. Hey, hey, Hachi. Okay, he's, he's rolling the dice. He's literally rolling the dice. Yeah. That entire round was a knowledge check. That whole round was just rolling the dice. The, all of the lights in front of him turned green. Man, Blazer really struggling to put something together here. Try to go for the um Give me that. Have again. a seat. Oh, we Get break those. Don't me. touch me, bro. One skill damage. Back turn. He's got a slight life deficit here. Nobody home. Now he's at the wall. One plus two throw. And he put him in a rage. This is a little dangerous. Uh, wait a minute. Jabated. He blocked? You, you can still block from out of that. You can still block from out of that. You can back turn quick oh, enough. Goodness. Absolutely talk about baited me. just now. And the counter hit slide in. He's showing signs of life here. He's got a pretty convincing life lead into the unblockable slap. Actually, that wasn't even unblockable. That's just oh. a hit. Nice duck nice there duck. from Blazer. The wall standing 2-2. All two right. Two. It's not going to be a complete wash. 2-1. This, this is similar to the last game. Blazer taking the first game. Still Electric coming back. Mm -hmm. Now he's showing signs of life. So it's 2-1 again. Let's see if he can... Run it back here. It's going to be an uphill battle. Now, notice he didn't actually switch, so he's going to stick with the double gen. Yep. Now, granted, he still has one more chance to. I think if it goes to 2-2, two, two, he, he might switch back to the Zafina, but I think he's filling DJ for now. Oh, Kenny. Oh, thank you. Thank you for bringing my, my Xbox controller. And we're going. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> We're going to. It, who, who said that? That's a good question. We'll find out after these messages. <laughs> <laughs> y'all haters. <laughs> Phil Spencer gave y'all half of y'all PCs that y'all play on now, okay? Hey, listen, man. Cameron gave me hitbox. <laughs> Join us. No. <laughs> and it is now game four here. 2 1 in favor of Still Electric on Hammerhead. My and immediate Electric stage. off of a blockable tackle. Excuse me. Power Crush tackle? Third best stage. Oh, he's making him really guess hard at the wall here. Hard oppression. Why is Devil Jin so good? I'm going to say, is that a 10 hit streak? <laughs> no, it was just hard oppression session. Mm, oh my god. What a catch. Not death. Oh. Yes, that is death. Oh, that's death. Never mind. That does way more damage than you realize. Never mind. <laughs> that shit hurt it. He d Yo, did you just do the Nate Brazzlers? Is, is, is this street? Did you just do the Nate Brazzlers? Back jump into Wild Stand. Back jump into DF2. Back jump while standing too. <laughs> We're getting ignorant. I like it. Matterhorn. Sidestep Matterhorn. We're getting, yo, we, we don't care. <laughs> we don't give a damn. All right, still Electro. He's like, all right, let me wake up now. Go, Blazer, go. Go, Blazer, go. <laughs> I'll snap with the power crush. Against slow. Yo, no, Jin, my God. Devil Jin got that sick, uh, that nightmare thing where nightmare was like, Ugh, just. <laughs> Damn. Soul Calibur. <laughs> Shout outs. Hopefully they make one with better netcode next time. Oh, no break. No, no um, laser. Well, it's not exactly confirmed after that, but you can use the laser. It's a, it's a gamble. Well, not much a gamble. You're, how many people are really going to get up and punish that one with? I won't. <laughs> I'm going to stay over here where it's safe. Oh, big whiff punish there from back turn. 
Oh, Ooh, caught him. Good. Caught him in the air. Back to. Oh, good block. He's got rage. Oh, with the float oh, combo. He is poking him and floating him out of the jump. Oh, went over his generic down four. This can hurt. He's going to the wall. No, he no. didn't get the dash in. He he didn't get his dash in. That's unfortunate. I know he wanted. All that right. was a misinput. Tournament point here for Still Electric. Final oh. round, game four. Again with the one plus two. Not not getting baited by those lasers. Got ten seconds. Down the clock. Oh, oh sidestep side pop, pop kick. kick to the wall. Flip him over. Good. And again with that mid slap, this is gonna hurt. Wait a minute, he's not dead yet. Oh, ooh, ooh. Don't he's get playing Street very Fighter carefully. Dun, 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 dun. Nice oh, to the side step with the down one. <laughs> that was close. He's bringing it. Game no. five. No, We're the, in a game the five. The was about to come out though. Like <laughs> somersault. <laughs> I mean, Devil Jin does have a somewhat summer song. <laughs> Technically, yes, but I don't want to be here to find out. Oh, big with punish. And, and nice conversion. And so does Lily. <laughs> Lily flipping all over the place. Good God. Ooh, oh, with the wall, wall bounce. bounce. That's going to smart. Oh. Oh, what a trade. What a GameStop trade. Wow, he wow. just ran back in. That was such a sick middle finger, it's not even funny. That middle, <laughs> that was sick. Oh, Ooh, nice duck the of the block. hell sweep. Telegraphed it. Mm. They liked your GameStop trade reference. <laughs> <laughs> the best that I can do. Just stop. <laughs> My boy starting to put the pressure. He tried to go Ooh. for the back sway. That's going to hurt. Ooh, counter hit. I like it. This is With death. the pickup. Oh, that boy got killed so hard, he died to death. All right. He's fighting back. It's 1-1 even is. in game five. He's, he's putting the hurting on him a little bit right now. He just might reset. Nice punish again. Yo, he is really starting to put pressure on this man just with spacing and lateral movement. The amount of sidesteps and punishment that he's getting just off of this. Well, ooh, this he's putting in the damage. Potential, uh, Again, reset. another sidestep hop kick. Okay. The Mishima staple. Mm, not quite. Didn't get the full combo. Oh, oh, and the woke counter up hit with the get counter up. Hit kick. This is going to hurt a little bit. He's not oh, dead. Oh, why didn't. Into the ankles, and he went with the generic two throw. And just like that, double Luigi. Are we getting a reset, or are we oh, getting nice a, interrupt. a champion? One plus two throw again. Oh, and the hell sweep. no. Oh, didn't follow up. Nice side step Matterhorn. Matterhorn. Oh, oh, he dropped it off axis. Uh, we're scrambling a little bit here. 15 seconds down the clock. Nice sidestep again. Ooh, try. He, I, I respect the try, but. Ooh, to the wall. Counter hit again. No, we punish those. Flash kick. He's, at, he's right outside of range of rage, too. And wow. dies with the red. <laughs> and down to game five, double Luigi. Still electric. Y'all let an invader. <laughs> successfully completed the invasion. Blazer Pearl put up a hell of a fight, though. In that last game, because honestly, if I'm if I do say so myself, I'm more intimidated by this dude's Devil Jin than his Athena. Because <laughs> I'm be really, when he picked Devil Jin, he he actually got the harder character, in my opinion, mm -hmm. of still electric repertoire. Zafina is absolutely ridiculous, but his his DJ does damage. That was that was a hell of a grand finals. Well, shout outs to uh, still electric coming in in first place. Oh, uh, he wants to come talk on the mic, so I'll let you do the honors, Afro. Come on over here, champ. Let's have a talk with you real quick. Let's, let's have a talk with you, Danny. Go for broke. It's been a while since you've been here, my boy. Impressive performance here. How you feeling? How you feeling? How's, how's the 
How's the stay in Philly been thus far? Ah, oh, man. Philly is hidden gems everywhere you turn. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about, like, I walked into a barber shop, and behind a enclosed door was another bar. You know what I'm saying? Hidden yes, gems. Hidden gems. Um, I'm having a great time, man. I actually, this is probably my second Go For Broke. The last time I came to Go For Broke was in New Jersey, and JDCR came to, to pay a friendly uh, visit. The winter championship. Yep, I recall. Crazy. And everybody was pissed. <laughs> All the locals was pissed. It's like, what the hell? But I think the pot was like five grand like or something 3K, like that. 3K, 5K, go it was for broke winner in Atlantic City. I remember that. It was probably one of the easiest tournaments he's ever won. And he was like, yo, thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. This, this though, wasn't easy. My man Blazin, he was putting up a fight. Yet he still calls himself a casual. <laughs> he, he, already, he just he was like, yo, you leaving? <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. Yo, you know when you win a tournament and somebody asks you if you leaving, bro, mm -hmm. it's a problem. Mm -hmm. He's like, yo, you leaving or you just going to stay? Yeah. But he um he put up a fight. <laughs> and to be honest, I put myself in a bad situation because I really don't like Devil Jin versus Lily. I was surprised that you picked that. I actually expected the Zafina again, even though I think that's definitely your better character between the two. I was very surprised that you actually went with the DJ. DJ needs love, man. You know what I'm saying? That's fair. He needs he needs love. And um, in winners finals, I did run Zafina, and I felt comfortable in that fight. So I knew that if it was a reset, she was my backup. Okay. So I was like, let me let me let me put him to the test. Let me have some faith, and put Devil Jin out there in one of these fights that I think is personally one of his bad matchups. Although Devil Jin as a character, I think is complete, and he has the tools to to win. I she agree. She can just she can just get around him a lot. You know, it's annoying. Um, so, you know, that's that. That's that. That was a good time. That was, that was a, even for like a small six man bracket, that was action. <laughs> it was, it was all action. It was a cute bracket. <laughs> it was a real cute bracket. But it's Commander. That is an excellent question. I came looking for you. Hey, Commander. listen, man. He's busy being a family man at the moment. We'll, we'll see you next time, though. I came looking for you, Commander. <laughs> But thank you anyway. Next time, you know I got to see that run back, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we'll, yeah. we'll get Philly versus Boston cracking soon enough. Oh, I, I know I, we've been waiting for that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, I love our co collaboration. I love hey, our listen, collaboration. Man. Philly man. to Boston. You know how we do. Come on, man. One hour flight, bro. It was a one hour flight to get here. You know what I'm saying? One hour to so you thank know, enjoy the times here. Thank you. Have to get yourself some good food. And as we recommend it, mm. you ever find yourself in Philly, you find yourself in Reading Terminal, mm. I'm always going to recommend two spots mm. Tommy the Knicks. Get mm. the roast pork and broccoli rob sandwich to die for. Okay. And you can't leave here without getting Baylor's donuts. At least two. I'm always say a half a dozen. Absolutely. I don't even know what Dunkin' Donuts is. No. <laughs> What's Dunkin'? I only know Baylor's. Hey, yo, that's the staple, man. But you're right. It's basic donuts, though. You know what I'm saying? Big fat. Get yourself the good stuff. The cream, the creme de la creme. All right. You know what? Y'all are the foodies. I'm going to take y'all advice. And you know what? Thank you very much, too. Shout out to you for hooking up my boy Quintel Brown with a new barber. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Like, that man was getting the wackest cuts in some suburb in, in Jersey. And I was like, bro, listen, you are so close to Philly. Ask Afro where you, where you go for good barbershops. Mm -hmm. And you sent that man here, and now he's hooked. Oh, listen, when it comes to Philly, we, we know good barber system. Come on. I was like... My uncle barbershop right here. Come he'll, on. he'll set you straight. Come on. He'll get you right. Come on. He'll get you crispy Come clean, on. man. Come on, man. I know what to do. Thank you all. Thank y'all, Philly. Thanks for having me. I appreciate you. And once again, this has been Go For Broke once again with our Boston homie Still Electric. And once again, it's your main man with the hair picking hand, Afronomical. And we will see y'all next time for the next Go For Broke. Y'all have yourselves a nice evening. Peace. <laughs>